everybody, I'm back, and uh, today I went and I saw Alita Battle Angel. Originally I wasn't going to do this review because it came out like a month ago, but I just liked it so much that I wanted to do a review for it anyway. Um, I was pretty excited for Alita in the first place because it looked very fun, but it ended up having a, a pretty driving story that I was very interested in. I liked the story. The environment they created for this story to take place in was a very interesting, fascinating concept. Not unlike Elysium. It was something that I very much enjoyed. Despite from what I had heard, I think that the characters were actually well written. Hugo. He was a good character. Wasn't my favorite, but he was a well-rounded character. Shirin was also well made. And she had her own character arc. Ido, may have, who may have been my favorite character, had quite a bit of background and was definitely not flat. And Alita herself was a very interesting character. The violence was a bit more than I expected, but it wasn't enough to keep me from liking the movie. I am not familiar with the manga comics from which the movie came, but I managed to enjoy the movie quite a bit nonetheless. Only minor problems I had with the movie was that it was clearly made to be the first in a series. There were lots of plot holes that were left undone to the point where it's clear that they intend to make more. Which isn't horrible, but I just wish they made it one movie, you know. I wish they wouldn't try so hard to make things in a series and just make one solid movie. But other than that, I can't really find much to complain about in Alita Battle Angel. I just really enjoyed that movie. Overall, I think I'll give Alita Battle Angel a 9 out of 10. It was a good movie. And I think I'll leave it at that. Till next time, people. Nuclear Films, out.